Okay, hi students, how are you? Next new chapter periodic table or periodic classification. Next new chapter is periodic table or periodic classification or classification of variants. Periodic table. Part 1. What is periodic table? What is periodic table? The arrangement of all known elements according to their properties in such a way that the elements of similar properties are grouped together in a tabular form is called periodic table. What is periodic table? The arrangement of elements and properties. Arrangement of elements and similar properties grouped together in tabular form is called arrangement of all elements. Okay, properties such way that is similar properties are grouped together in tabular form is called periodic table. What is period? The arrangement of elements. Okay. The arrangement of elements and similar properties grouped together in tabular form is called periodic table. Periodic table. Next one is development of periodic table. Development of periodic table. First classification, Lavoisier classification. The scientist name, Lavoisier scientist name. Lavoisier scientist classified, Lavoisier classification. What is the Lavoisier classification here? Lavoisier classified elements simply in metals and non-metals. Lavoisier scientist classified simply metals, non-metals. Okay, non-metals. Metals are positive charge species. Non-metals are negative charge species. Come here. Metals are metals are metals are the one which have the tendency to lose the electrons. Losing electrons is called metals. Gadif electron is called non-metals. Metals are one H have the tendency of losing of electrons. Losing of electrons. Here, this is for example, this is sodium metal. Sodium metal lose one electron to form sodium plus ion. Here, one more example, potassium take potassium lose one electron to form potassium. Lose of electrons is called metals. Gain of electrons is called non-metals. Gain of electrons are called non-metals. Example is fluorine. Chlorine is non-metal. Fluorine gain one electron to form F minus ion. Chlorine gain one electron to form Cl minus ion. Gaining of electrons are called non-metals. Okay, losing of electrons are called metals. This is example for metals, non-metals. Okay, what is Lavoisier classification? Lavoisier scientists classified metals and non-metals losing of electrons are called metals example is sodium lose one electron to form sodium plus one more example potassium lose one electron to form potassium plus next non-metals non-metals are the non-metals are the which have the tendency of gain of electron gain of electrons are called non-metals example is fluorine chlorine is non-metal fluorine gain one electron to form f minus Chlorine gain one electron to form Cl minus. Okay, that is positive charge species are called metals. Negative charge species are called non-metals. Got my point? Very good. Next one. Next classification is next classification that is next drawbacks. Drawbacks or limitations. As the number of elements increases, this classification become insufficient for the study of elements. As the number of elements increases. This classification became insufficient for the study of elements. Next drawback is there are few elements which have this the properties of both metals as well non-metals. This classification few elements are that is properties of both metals as well as non-metals and they are called metalloids. Okay, few elements. Okay, exhibit properties of metals and non-metals. That type of elements are called metalloids. Next point, Lavoisier scientists could not decide where to place the metalloids. Okay, here drawback observe here. The second drawback is few elements which have the properties of both metals and non-metal properties. Thus, these elements are called metalloids. But that Lavoisier scientists could not decide the position of the metalloids. Lavoisier could not decide where to place the 
metalloids okay this is drawbacks or limitations of lavaizer classification drawbacks next one is prost hypothesis unitary theory prost hypothesis he simply assumed that all the elements were made up of hydrogen so we can as the atomic weight of element is equal n into atomic weight of one hydrogen atom what is the formula of prost hypothesis formula is atomic weight of element is equal n into atomic weight of one hydrogen atom one hydrogen atom okay now atomic weight of hydrogen is one atomic weight of hydrogen is one where n is equal number of hydrogen atom is equal 1 2 3 4 and so on okay atomic weight of element is equal n into atomic weight of one hydrogen atom one hydrogen atom atomic weight of hydrogen is equal to 1 where n is equal number of hydrogen atom like 1 2 3 4 5 like this one drawbacks and limitations of first hypothesis every element cannot be formed by hydrogen every element cannot formed by hydrogen atomic weight of all elements was not found as the whole number atomic weight of all elements was not found as the whole number for example chlorine atomic weight is 35.5 and strontium atomic weight is 87.6 what the point of the second point atomic weight of all elements as not atomic weight of all elements was not found as the whole numbers for example chlorine atomic weight is 35.5 strontium atomic weight is 87.6 next one third one is davernier tried rule what is third one is davernier tried rule tried means three he made groups of three elements having similar chemical properties called tried tried means three elements e davernier tried atomic weight of middle element is nearly equal to the average atomic weight of the first and third element see observe carefully here observe ma davernier tried tried means three elements 1 2 3 a group of three elements this is uh, which group seventh a group elements seventh a group elements observe a group of three elements a group of three elements having similar properties a group of three elements have similar chemical properties is called tried a group of three elements having similar properties is called tried okay according to davernier tried atomic weight is according to davernier tried atomic weight of middle element is nearly this is first element second element third element okay the atomic weight of atomic weight of middle element atomic weight of middle element is nearly equal to average atomic mass of first and third element here first element is 35.5 third element is 127 average mean mass 35.5 in plus 127 by 2 is equal 81.2 that is nearly what the point is given the atomic weight of middle element is nearly equal to the average atomic weight of first and third element that is near value 8 is given what is math that is uh, davernier tried a group of three elements having similar chemical properties is called tried tried means three elements here according to davernier tried davernier atomic weight of uh, atomic weight of second element is it nearly equal to the average mean of the first and the third element okay now for example average mean what is that one chlorine is 35.5 plus third element is 127 by 2 is equal 88 81.2 81.2 Two, that is nearly near value. Second element is atomic weight is near value. Next one more example take a group of three elements. A group this is second group elements. Second a group elements. A group of three elements having similar properties is called tried. Tried means three elements. 
okay first element this is second element third element average mean of the atomic weight of second element is nearly equal to average mean of the first and third element that is value is 88.5 near value next a group of three elements this third example a group of three elements this is first a group elements a group of three elements having similar chemical properties is called trite trite means three elements next this first second third element atomic weight of second element is nearly equal to average mean of the first and third element okay that is atomic second element 23 or 23 okay, equal or nearly equal okay this is davenier trite rule next that is where x is equal to average atomic weight other example potassium rubidium cesium okay polonium what is phosphorus arsenic antimony sulfur selenium thelium hydrogen fluorine chlorine this all other examples davenier traits drawbacks or limitations of drawbacks or limitations of davenier trait all the known elements could not be arranged as traits it is not applicable for d and f block elements it is not applicable for d and f block elements all the known elements could not be arranged in traits arranged as traits it is not applicable for d and f block elements okay some moral question observe here question number 1 is iron cobalt nickel a davenier trait no these elements belongs to same period these elements are belongs to the three elements are belongs to same period next question number 2 the law of trade is applicable to okay what is applicable to is here what is chlorine bromine iodine the law of trade is applicable to chlorine bromine why because a group of three elements a group of three elements having similar chemical properties is called trade okay first element this is second element this is third element okay the atomic weight of second element is is nearly equal to the average mean of the first and third element okay that average value is 81.2 next one is newland actor rule actor means eight eight electrons eight he arranged the elements in the increasing order of their atomic masses and observed that the properties of every eight element was similar to the first element like in the case of musical vowels notation sa re ga ma pa da ni sa okay what is lapsar here one point observe carefully newland octave rule octave means nothing but eight he arranged newland and arranged the elements in the increasing order of atomic increasing order of atomic masses he observed the properties of every eighth element was similar to the first element what the point is given here observe carefully newland sent test arrange the elements are increasing order of atomic weight increasing order of atomic weight or atomic mass and observe that properties of every eighth element was similar to the first element like in the case of musical vowels notation sa re ga ma pa da ni sa sir first element an eighth element what that is this first element and eighth element what are the properties is similar properties observe properties of every eighth element was similar to the first element this eighth element and first element is properties is same similar okay that is what is telling the point is you observe every eighth element properties and first element properties same okay octave is nothing but eight octave is nothing but eight see one example i'll give one example observe here at at that time inert gases were not known that time inert gases is not included that time okay at that new land time inert gases are not included in periodic table see observe here careful observe at that time inert gases were not known inert gases are not known sir observe what the point is given 
first element and eighth element is property same 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 and 8 first and eight elements similar properties correct or not according to newland what is every eighth element is similar properties to first element ok octo means eight next you take this one one two three four five six seven eight ok every eight element is similar properties to first element that is called newland active here noble gases not included that time not find out noble gases uh, this rule is applicable up to calcium only what are, this rule is applicable to this rule is applicable up to calcium the calcium atomic number is 20 mass number is 40 newland active rule is applicable up to calcium only in this time noble gases are not find out are not known not included in this time that is at the time inert gases or noble gas were not known that is why you are not at inert gases what is the newland acted rule every eighth element is similar properties to first element ok that is called newland active active means 8 next the properties of lithium are similar to 8th element that is sodium and properties of beryllium are similar to magnesium and so on. What is the point? The properties of lithium are similar to 8th element. Sodium and properties of beryllium are similar to magnesium. Lithium are similar to 8th element. Sodium similar properties. Next properties of beryllium similar to magnesium ok now what is that is newland acted rule every eighth element similar properties to the first element here give example lithium is first element sodium is eighth element here beryllium is first element here magnesium is eighth element like similar properties that the next one is drawbacks or limitations of newland active observe this rule is valid only up to calcium all right only this rule is applicable up to calcium element because after calcium due to the presence of d black elements there is difference of 18 electrons instead of 8 elements what reason this rule is valid up to calcium because after calcium due to presence of d black elements there is difference of 18 el 18 elements instead of 8 elements d black elements enter next after the discovery of inert gases and including them of the periodic table it becomes the eighth element from all clean metals so this lie had to be dropped out this lie is dropped out after the discovery of inert gases including them into the periodic table it becomes the eighth element from all clean metals so this law had to be dropped out this is drawbacks very important point what is the point is the complete level okay newland active rule is applicable up to calcium element that atomic number is 20 mass number is 40 this point keep to your brain this is very very important in complete level okay in drawbacks that is newland active okay it is applicable to calcium up to calcium element next Lothar Mayer curve. Next one is Lothar Mayer curve. He floated, Lothar said he floated curve between atomic weight and atomic mass, atomic volume of different elements. The graph, the graph is drawn between atomic volume versus atomic weight. The graph is drawn between atomic volume versus atomic weight basically lithium sodium lithium sodium potassium rubidium cesium first group elements 
okay the graph is drawn between atomic volume versus atomic weight what is atomic volume is nothing but atomic volume atomic volume is equal atomic weight by density atomic volume is equal atomic weight by density e flatter lather mayer scientist plot a curve between atomic weight and or say and atomic volume the graph is drawn between atomic volume versus atomic weight okay now here atomic volume is equal atomic weight by density this classification is based on atomic volume only lather mayer classification is based on atomic volume atomic volume is equal atomic weight by density the graph is uh, drawn between atomic volume versus atomic weight point number 1 most l pro positive elements that is alkali metals lithium sodium potassium rubidium occupy the peak position on the curve observe carefully these all are first a group elements this first a group elements okay this first a group elements are all alkali metals these all alkali metals are occupy the maximum peak of the curve maximum peak of the curve point number 1 point number 2 less electro positive element that is alkaline earth metal beryllium magnesium calcium strontium barium occupy the descending position of the curve okay this is descending position descending position descending position what that is lithium lithium second a group elements beryllium magnesium calcium strontium barium and this are second a group elements or second a group elements are all alkaline earth metals that is this are occupy this second a group elements are all alkaline metals are occupy the descending position of the curve descending position of the curve next metalloids and transition elements occupy bottom part of the curve here bottom bottom of metalloids and transition elements are bottom part of the curve bottom part of the curve next one more important halogens are also there halogens are occupying halogens are occupying what is halogens are occupying ascending position of the curve okay halogens are occupying ascending position of the curve here three points observe lather mayer classification this lather mayer classification based on atomic volume what is atomic volume is equal atomic weight by density okay the graph is drawn between atomic volume versus atomic weight okay here observe carefully first a group elements are called alkali metals alkali metals are arranged in what is that is occupy the maximum peak next L less electro positive element that is alkan ethyl alkan ethyl metal that is second group elements are occupy the descending position of the curve next halogens are occupy the halogens means what is halogens chlorine fluorine chlorine bromine iodine these all are ascending position of the curve next metalloids and transition metalloids are transition elements are bottom of the curve bottom of the curve this is lather mayer classification lather mayer curve next most electro negative elements that is halogens occupy the ascending position of the curve already given this point before only okay that is the most electro negative elements that is halogens are occupy the ascending position of the curve you are note important point observe elements having similar properties occupy similar positions on the curve elements having similar properties occupy similar position of the curve here one conclusion point also given on the basis of this curve lather mayer proposed that the physical properties of the elements are periodic function of their atomic weight and this become the basis of mendeleev periodic table what is conclusion point what here on the basis of lather mayer proposed the physical properties of the elements are periodic functions of their atomic weight and this become the base of mendeleev periodic table next which table is enter mendeleev mendeleev's 
period table enter next one what is periodic function lathermeyer fizak function when the elements are arranged in the increasing order of when the elements are arranged in increasing order of atomic weight elements having similar properties and get represented after a regular interval that is called periodic function okay when elements are arranged in increasing order of atomic weight atomic weight elements have similar properties this is called periodic function observe carefully the, the graph is drawn between this ma lather mayer graph atomic volume versus atomic mass is nothing but atomic weight this all are first year group elements this first year group elements are okay maximum position of the curve this is second year group elements this second year group elements are which position that is descending position of the curve descending position of the curve next all regions are ascending position of the curve now here metallites are bottom of this metallites and transition elements clear diagram is given curve here observe carefully lather mayer curve the graph is drawn between atomic volume versus atomic mass or atomic weight first year group elements are alkali metals are okay i position of the curve the this is second year group elements are alkali metals are descending position of the curve allogens are ascending position of the curve metallites and transition elements are bottom of the curve next one mendeleev periodic table this is very very important mendeleev scientists mendeleev periodic table the physical and chemical properties of the elements or the periodic functions of their atomic weight the physical and chemical properties of the elements or the periodic functions of their atomic weight that is called mendeleev periodic table la characteristics of mendeleev periodic table it was based on atomic weight it was based on atomic weight or atomic mass 63 elements were known that time nobel gases were not discovered it is based on atomic mendeleev periodic table is based on atomic weight 63 elements only known that time nobel gases were not included or discovered next he was the first scientist to classify the element in a systematic manner that is horizontal rows and vertical columns mendeleev is first scientist to classify the elements in systematic manner mendeleev is first scientist to classify the elements in a systematic manner that is uh, horizontal rows and in vertical columns horizontal rows are called periods vertical columns are called groups listen here horizontal rows we are called periods and there are seven periods in mendeleev periodic table okay horizontal rows are called periods vertical columns are called groups these are my important points mendeleev characteristic points of characteristic properties of mendeleev periodic table first one it is based on atomic weight or atomic mass 63 elements are known that time but noble gases were not discovered he is first scientist to classify the elements in systematic manner that is horizontal rows and vertical columns horizontal rows are called periods there are seven periods vertical columns are called groups okay how many groups is there one check here next find i already given here here vertical columns are called groups and there are eight groups in mendeleev periodic table vertical columns are called vertical columns are called groups and there are eight groups in mendeleev periodic table what is the before point horizontal rows are called period seven periods mendeleev periodic table now vertical columns are called groups and are eight groups in mendeleev periodic table each group up to seven was divided into a and b sub groups a sub group element we are called normal elements b sub group elements are called transition elements each group up to 7 divided into a and b sub groups a group elements are called normal elements b group sub group elements are called transition elements 
next one the eight group was consisted nine elements in three rows that is called transition group the three groups the eighth group was consisted of nine elements in three rows that is called transitional metal group next one the elements belong to same group exhibit similar properties or same properties the elements belong to same group exhibit similar properties these all are mentally important points next one is merits and advantages of mendeley priya table merits and advantages of mendeley priya table first point study of elements first time all known elements were classified in groups according to similar properties so study of the properties of elements becomes easier next point periodic prediction of new elements it gave encouragement to dis discover the new elements as uh, some gaps were left in it what is the gap the missing elements is scanium gallium germanium technetium these all are missing elements some gap these are by this where the elements for whose position and properties were well defined by mendeleev even before their discoveries and he left the blank spaces for the in this table okay some space blank space is given these are missing elements blank space at atomic weight 72 is silicon group it was called eco silicon eco silicon means properties like silicon and element discovered there later named as germanium blank space at atomic weight 72 in silicon group was called eco silicon means properties like silicon and element discovered later by later was named germanium element discovered later was named is germanium it is a merits advantages of mendeleev periodic table this is merits and advantages of mendeleev periodic table share similarly other elements discovered after mendeleev periodic table see other elements eco aluminum that is gallium missing elements eco boron scandium eco silicon germanium eco manganese technetium other element discovered after mendeleev periodic table eco aluminum gallium eco boron scandium eco silicon germanium eco manganese technetium next one is correction of doubtful atomic weights correction of doubtful atomic weight correction were done in atomic weight of some elements atomic weight is equal valence into atomic weight is equal valence into equivalent weight atomic weight is equal valence into equivalent weight initially it was found that equivalent weight of beryllium is 4.5 and it is a trivalent valence is 3 so the weight of beryllium is 13.5 13 and there is no space in mendeley priya table for this element so after correction it was found that the beryllium actually bivalent the valence is 2 so the weight of beryllium become 2 into 4 point this is valence 2 into that is equivalent weight is equal 9 here atomic weight is equal beryllium valence into equivalent weight valence is 2 equivalent weight is 4 point weight okay what is atomic uh, what is equivalent weight is equal formula equivalent weight is equal equivalent weight is equal atomic weight by valence for example beryllium beryllium atomic weight equivalent weight find out beryllium atomic weight is 9 the valence is 2 is equal 4.5 beryllium equivalent weight is 4.5 they are sir but atomic weight is equal valence and equivalent weight valence is 2 equivalent weight is 4 that is total is 9 beryllium atomic weight is 9 and there was space between lithium and and there was space between lithium 
and boron for this element in periodic table. Okay, where the beryllium atom is included here, periodic table, lithium and boron between beryllium is space. Lithium and boron between beryllium element is included. Okay, after correction. What is atomic weight is equal to valence into equivalent weight? What is equivalent weight formula? Atomic weight by valency. Beryllium, for example, you take beryllium atom, equivalent weight is atomic weight 9 by valency 2 is equal to 4.5. Now, what is formula? Atomic weight is beryllium is equal to valence into equivalent weight. Valence into 2, equivalent weight is 4.5, that is, is equal to 9, that is, atomic weight of beryllium. Correction of then in atomic weight of element where uranium, beryllium, indium, gold, platinum, other elements. Demerits of Mendeleev table. First one, position of hydrogen atom. Position of hydrogen atom. First one is position of hydrogen atom. Hydrogen res resembles both the alkali metals and the halogens. Okay, hydrogen atom resembles both alkali metals and halogens. Okay, alkali metals are first A group elements. Alkali ethyl metals is second A group elements. Now, halogens are seventh A group elements. In properties, so Mendeleev could not decide where to place it. Position of hydrogen atom. Hydrogen resembles both the alkali metals and the halogens. In the properties, so Mendeleev could not decide where to put place. Next, position of isotopes. As atomic weight of isopod differs, they should have been placed at different positions in Mendeley periodic table. But there were no such places for isotope in Mendeley periodic table. Isotope place also not decide, hydrogen place also not decide in this time. Anomalous sphere of elements. What is anomalous place of elements? There were some pair of elements which did not follow the increasing order of atomic weight. Okay. There were some pair of elements which did not follow the increasing order of atomic weight. For example, argon cobalt were placed before potassium and nickel. Okay, these two elements. These two elements. This is atomic weight is argon is 40, here potassium is 39, this sphere. Okay, before is okay, what is that is it is which did not follow increasing order of atomic weight, correct or not? That right. These two pair of elements, for example, you take argon and potassium. These two pair of elements which do not follow increasing order of atomic weight. Why? Because the photo argon atomic weight is 40. Potassium 39 atomic weight. These two pair of elements not follows, did not follow increasing order of atomic weight. So, what happened? 1490 decrease in atomic weight. Here 40 atomic number increases, but atomic weight is decreases. That is why that is called anomal sphere. One more again, cobalt and nickel also. Same. Some examples given here. Argon, potassium, tellinium, indium, thorium, potassium, cobalt, nickel. Okay, atomic weight is more. Here yeah, 39 by 9. Argon, potassium, observe here. Argon, potassium. Argon, atomic weight 39 by 9. That is nearly 40. That is, potassium is 39. Round of value. What is atomic number increases? Atomic weight is decreases. That is called the atomic weight is not increasing order that is anomalous fair some other examples also given cobalt nickel also given next point like elements were placed in different groups like elements were placed in different groups there were some elements like platinum gold which of the similar properties but were placed in different groups in Mendeley period table like elements were placed in different groups, there were some elements like platinum and gold which have similar properties but were placed in different groups in Mendeley period. What are the elements is platinum, which group, eighth group, gold, A, RM, 
first A group. Okay, platinum eighth group, armor gold first A group, first B group. Platinum eighth A group, gold or armies which group? First B group. Last one. Unlike elements were placed in same group. Unlike elements were placed in same group. This is first group, first A group element, first B group element. This is a first group, first B, first A and first B. Same group, first group elements. Now here, lithium, sodium. Okay, that is a, a sodium is bridged element. This R2 is lithium, sodium is first group elements. Okay, here, Potassium, rubidium, cesium is also first group elements. Okay, there sec, first B group elements. This is first A group elements, first B group elements. First group elements are called coinage metals or coinage metals or coinage elements. It is called transition elements. Okay, here co copper, silver, gold. This three is first B group elements or coinage metals. Also known as transition metals, these are less reactive, less reactive elements. These are first A group elements, potassium, rubidium, cesium. These are more reactive elements, and electro positive elements is nothing but alkali metals. Alkali metals. Okay, first group elements subdivided into two groups. One is first A group elements, first B group. First B group elements, which group is there here? Which elements? Kinase elements or kinase metals. That is, uh, example, copper, silver, gold. That is, uh, reactivity is less reactivity, transition element. First A group element, potassium, rubidium, cesium. This is more reactivity, alkali metals, normal elements. Okay, first A group elements are normal elements. This first B group elements are transition elements. Simple. This transition elements are called what reactivity is less reactive? Here, normal elements are more reactive. Okay, now here observe here next copper, silver, gold, arm placed in first group along with sodium, potassium. It is while these differ in their properties, only similar in having NS1 electronic configuration. Here, what is here? Configuration only, but outermost electronic configuration is same. Okay, but different properties. Properties different, but electron configuration is same. Next, it was not clear that how lanthanides and actinides are related with a third A group or third B group. What is the mainly periodic table? It was not clear that how lanthanides and actinides are related with a third A group or third B group. These all are the important points of the table. Okay, now, okay, students, bye. Tomorrow we'll meet. Bye, see.